had to do with uh, the loss of their baby, and it had to do with um, this media event that, uh, you know, it just sort of sprang uh, up all of a sudden. In Texas, there's a posse theory, and the theory is when a fellow officer is in trouble, everybody jumps into their automobiles, all, all the fellow officers, and they fall in behind to try to help the guy out. And the posse theory uh, sort of is, you know, the backdrop of Sugarland Express. I was able to, with, within the budget of my picture, afford 40 police cars. And in real life, 90 police cars were involved in a bumper-to-bumper -bumper pursuit that was strung out over uh, about 150 miles. I had seen Goldie in Butterflies Are Free, and there was one scene she had with Eileen Heckert in the car that I felt was, uh, it was, it was really, you know, heart-turning. And uh, I knew that there was a serious actor so somewhere underneath that laughing facade. She was anxious to break out of that mold and, and do something dramatic and do something very serious, and that's why she became a part of the, you know, the company, and that's why uh, I hired her. You seem to get very strong performances and naturalistic performances from your actors. What's your technique? I don't know if it's so much of a technique. I asked, I asked the actor to, <clears throat> for the most part, to, to give me too much so I can then take it down to a level that I, that I feel is believable. I don't like casting actors who are low-key people. I like people with energy. So in, in the initial casting, I think that half of what a director does is cast his picture well. And, and, and the other half is, uh, is you know, the, the, the control of the people within that. But I think half of the secret, when you do see a good picture and you like the people, it's in the casting. Uh, I, I like people who are outspoken and who are very large so I can bring them down to life level. No, it doesn't come easily. I don't even think about it. If I thought about multi-million dollar pictures and all the equipment and all the responsibility, I'd probably go bananas. <laughs>